Now, here's your forecast first from Fox 11 severe weather expert Patrick Powell. A little bit of light snow is trying to fall, especially right up and down 29 and just to the north of that. It's been working down from Anago towards Shawano and kind of working towards the Green Bay area. We are going to see some little bouts of some light snow showers at times as this cloud band is streaming in from the northwest and some of this actually does have a little bit of light snow. Right now cloudy skies 17 though. It's as warm as we've been all day. Winds west southwest at 8 miles an hour. Dew points currently at 8. We'll fall to 7 tomorrow morning. Could see a couple of flurries at times during the overnight hours and then 14 at noon and some more light snow tries to move in late tomorrow. Tomorrow's high around 18. Severe weather index in the low category. Some light snow showers at times. A few light snow showers overnight tonight and then more come in late tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow night and into Saturday. And with that occasional snow moving through the area, I think we're going to pick up an inch or two over the next two days. So not a lot of snow, but some light bouts of snow at times. Chance for snow obviously late tonight and again during the day tomorrow. Another shot for snow on Saturday, shot for more accumulating snow on Monday and then another chance the end of next week, Thursday into Friday. Temperatures though are going to improve overall a bit. Still some cold days mixed in. Average high is 29, but at least we get some highs in the mid 20s during the extended forecast. Temperature right now 18 in Appleton. Wind chill is at 8 around the state. Most folks sitting in the teens at this point and wind chills have rebounded in at least in a positive single digits through most of Wisconsin. It's this little batch of snow that's been driving towards the southeast as we've been moving through the afternoon evening hours. And you can really see it now kind of streaming down towards Green Bay. And then there's another little batch out to the northwest. And there's another one northwest of there. And it seems to be staying right on this plane that's kind of running right across the central parts of Wisconsin, separating two areas of high pressure. So as long as that's occurring, we're going to have this little unsettled settled weather around the area with some flurries, nothing terribly organized, but some light snow showers at times. Then as we move into Friday night and Saturday, a storm moves by to the south. We'll get winds off Lake Michigan, and that's going to help not only give us some light snow, but it's also going to enhance and lake effect type snow in the eastern counties of Wisconsin. So overnight, a couple of flurries. We'll see some more snow showers at times, especially late tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night. And that's going to continue into Saturday. Snowfall amounts, though, not terribly impressive. Most of the area will probably pick up one to two inches in total over the next two to two and a half days. For tonight, mostly cloudy, some flurries possible, seven for the overnight low. Tomorrow, light snow showers coming in again late in the day and into tomorrow night, 18 for the high, and then occasional light snow showers and 24 on Saturday, 12, a little brief cool down for Sunday as we get more sunshine, and then some more snow comes back on Monday. Monday's high, 27, 27 again on Tuesday, and then 12 Wednesday and 16 Thursday, but some more snow starts to come back in, especially during the afternoon hours on Thursday, and that will run into Thursday night. Right now it looks like that could be a significant storm running into Friday, something we'll have to watch sure. because that is the weekend before Christmas. So a lot of people will be traveling that next weekend, so a storm we'll have to watch seven days out right now. Okay, sounds good, but until then, cold. Cold and some bouts of snow. All right, thanks, Patrick.